Hi there, welcome back. I'm so excited today because I'm going to present to you this amazing pineapple fried rice. Ta da! Who doesn't like sweet, juicy pineapple? It's so tropical. Even better, you can make this fried rice in less than 30 minutes. Let's get started with the shrimp. Put a dash of salt while we prepare the pineapple. An easy trick to know if your pineapple is ripe or not is to gently tuck the center leaf. If it comes out easily, then it's ready. If not, maybe you want to wait for a couple more days, like this one. But I decided to eat it anyway. We're going to use half of this pineapple to make a beautiful pineapple ball. Use a very big sharp knife to cut through the pineapple, including the leaves. Then we're going to use a small knife and cut around the pineapple. You want to cut it down to the bottom, but not cut through. We're going to do two cuts around the core lengthwise and then cut the pineapple into small sections. Get a big spoon and scoop out the pineapple chunks around the two sides. Eat some if you want, we really just need one cup of chopped pineapple. For the middle section, now we can cut off the core with a small knife and then scoop out the rest of the fruit. Here is our pineapple bowl. Chopped out the pineapple into small pieces. Besides shrimp, we also need two eggs, one green onion, and a couple slices of ham. Chop up the ham and chop up the green onion. Let's crack the eggs and oops, oh, <laughs> and add a dash of salt. Beat the eggs really well until it's frothy. Now let's put everything together on a smoking hot pan. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. You don't need a smoking hot. Put two tablespoons of cooking oil and fry the shrimp until they change its color slightly. And then take out the shrimp, we don't want to overcook them. Again, more oil, and then we're going to fry the green onions. Push the onions to the side, and we're going to scramble the eggs. Again, more oil. Cannot make fried rice without oil. And a lot of it actually. We're going to put in the ham, and if you have some frozen peas and carrots and other frozen stuff, add them all in. Why not? Let's add in one cup of freshly chopped pineapple. Has your mouth ever hurt after eating pineapple? Well, if you cook them, that will not be an issue. Let's add in three cups of cooked rice. It's better if the rice is a little bit drier. You can use leftover rice, of course, or when you cook the rice, add slightly less water than usual. For seasoning, we're going to add one teaspoon of curry powder. It is going to give our rice a nice golden color. And then one tablespoon of soy sauce and one tablespoon of fish sauce. I like how squid brand fish sauce says it doesn't actually contain squid. <laughs> Stir everything well together and we are done. Oh, oops, I forgot the shrimp. Yes, we need to add in the shrimp and now you are done. As you can see, you can totally make this yummy fried rice in less than half an hour. And scoop it into the pineapple bowl and enjoy with your friends and family. If you like this video, like or subscribe. See you next time. Bye.